<laughs> All right, well, I'm loaded in and recording. You can do whatever. Tellernarnoid. He's a goat that you sacrifice in death metal songs. Oh, you're good at Artie. Well, Artie sucks a dick. Uh, lag. Dude, get a better internet. No, that's perhaps. Lol. Lol. Lol, my T1 is so fucking... <laughs> my T1's the exact opposite of your tank. Have you noticed that? You have no body and a large turret. I have no turret and... <laughs> Alright. Uh, oh, let's see if I can actually hit this guy. Oh god, he's twitching. Shit. Fraps is fucking me over right now. This isn't good. Is it? Yeah. Well, whatever. I somehow managed to get hit by something or other. I'm just gonna move. Because I have a feeling there'll be god beams. Loads of god beams. Oh yeah, and that's my other complaint about this gun. Not only does it do no damage, but it's also shit for accuracy. Yeah. Yep. There is absolutely not a single positive thing that I can say about this tank. And wow, I was lucky. I only got shot in the side. Oh Don't crap! T28. Hit him 55 percent. And Ed, Ed, can we get this last hit on him? Oh, you missed. You suck, you cannon. That was just a pure blind guess shot right there. Oh, hey, oh, there's shit. a T1 Heavy right now. Did you just get killed? Yeah. God beams? No. Where's Invisible the tank that killed you? Invisible people. Oh, okay. They're on the <laughs> hill. They get a bonus for that. Invisibility and stuff in this. Oh my god, I just missed this PZ4. What gives? What the fuckles? Seriously? Oh. Uh. I have fired four bloody shots. Ah. Uh, not a single one has yet to hit. God damn it. Well, that last one was my fault. I should have been leading him. There we go. Finally a hit, and it does 1% of damage. Seriously, bro? I'm a. I'm a tier higher, and he's a medium. I should be doing damage to him. There we go. Finally. He's a light if you want to kill him. Oh yeah, that's the guy who I have a shot on already. Oh, now I can't move. I've been tracked. Well, that dumbass just ran into a tree and... Oh dear lord, I am getting shot from everywhere and I'm done. <laughs> you see what I mean? This tank is made out of tinfoil and discarded Elvis albums. And... <laughs> yeah. Apparently... Uh, Apparently everyone can just see me for the next minute, even after I kill the guy who spotted me. Ah, game mechanics. Whatever. No point in raging out that I'm quitting. And I'm out of match. Tank and battle. Um, I am going to say th three to two that we lose that battle. Most likely, yes. Most of our team didn't move outside of the uh, base, really. Well, no. that and the fact is, uh, all three of our heavies died, and other than that, their team had the advantage. Uh, what else do you have besides that KV of yours that's T20, moderately uh, useful? M2 medium tank with the howitzer. And... Oh yeah, you told me you had elite status on that. Yeah. Wow, you actually bothered to unlock the radio. I applaud you for your patience. That's <laughs> what I do. Um, yeah, grab your 28. I'll go in with an 85B. Alrighty. Rip bitch is a new one. That's why it's called the B. Yeah, oh, I'm man. actually working my T28 to... It's almost at 75% crew. Nice. You should have retrained that crew for the KV. Actually, no, you can't do that because it's um. Isn't it's it considered a medium? Yeah. Yeah. So you'll actually take losses on that. That's kind of sucky. Oh well. Ooh, we have two Leos on our team. Leos are awesome, but at the same time, we have 3485s in the same match. What gives? 
Man. This game loves to hose you sometimes, mate. I swear. Oh, did you hear, um, the Russian version of it actually set the Guinness World Record for most players online in a single game? Hmm. All right. I noticed that because now I actually take a lot longer while Fraps is running, too. Yeah, they yeah. changed something. It didn't used to be that way. Uh, but yeah, what I was saying is uh, World of Tanks had something like 90-something thousand players online at the same time. Good. Yeah, and they have something like 400,000 or 500,000 accounts. So in other words, in the time that they've been out, they've managed to beat EVE on two counts. <laughs> and that's just in Russia. That's not worldwide. That is just Damn. in one nation. Say, World of Warcraft, eat your heart out, you stupid sons of bitches. <laughs> well, I mean, honestly, I completely see why Russian people like this game. Why people in general would like this game. It's a well thought out pretty decently executed concept and then people in Russia just love to play Russian games and love to play free games so it's they know their they know their demographics you know people in Russia don't tend to have a lot of money and this game is awesome for that I mean if you convert it to US dollars it's five bucks a month cheaper uh, than other MMOs because it's uh, ten bucks a month uh, I love this game because I just fucking love World War II era. Yeah. Yeah. I, mean, I like tanks. Like, tanks are kind of fucking awesome. I like, uh, I actually like warplanes a lot more than tanks. You like what, what? War, uh, warplanes, you know, procs. Oh, the, uh, like Il-2 Stormvik status? Hmm? Like Il-2 Stormvik status? Yeah, I love... I actually love those, uh... Are you actually any good at that game? I uh, used to be. I actually stopped playing those type of games. Well, it wasn't IL-2 that I played. It was, you know, like the... Ill. Shitty version. It's Ill, but, not uh, IL. I call it IL. I don't know. Well, I you're know. all wrong, including his shit. major Jeffiness. Oh, shit. I missed that bitch. Yeah, I missed the Churchill as well. I'm kind of getting oh, shat on this game by whatever reasons. I've gotten two lag spikes whenever I'm firing. Uh, stupid. Oh crap, I'm getting shot at by a T28. And I missed, and he didn't. This is not good. This is not good. Man, I'm done. A T28 gun is better than mine. <laughs> 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 That's right. That is why I say tank destroyers are not that hot. <laughs> because that thing has a swiveling turret, is faster than me, and can do more damage to more tanks. Ah, balls. Did you just get killed? Yeah. yeah. Come out, our T1 heavies are done, and as I predicted, lossage. <laughs> but yeah. I'm still waiting for my double XP. I want this new turret. Ah, man. Yeah, I, I uh, used to play those flight simulators to combat, uh, but it used to be pretty good, but then I just kind of sucked because I haven't played them in four years. Yeah, I made it, I made an active attempt to play Ill 2 Sturmvik last week. It ended up in one session, and during that one session I managed to take off, land, and get a kill. Actually, two kills. Uh, so that was quite impressive, because uh, being the, the complete tool that I am, I decided, fuck it, I'm going hard, and um, decided to play as a Russian pilot in an I-16, fighting a bunch of Messerschmitts 109s. <laughs> <laughs> so nice. it was it was just an unmitigated disaster because they were faster than me, they could turn nicer than me, mm -hmm. they had bigger guns, and I was just like, holy fuck, I can barely keep my plane level. Because also, you can't trim that plane, and it has manual landing gear. Which is <laughs> like, which it is hands yeah. down the most, the worst plane you could get coming into that game as a newbie. <laughs> and I decided yeah. to play as it. So what do you know? <laughs> my uh, my favorite uh, plane of well, of course, is American. But uh, the little dual engine motherfucker. Oh yeah, that's, 
That little bitch is nuts. I love that thing. Yo, fuck you know, that thing sucks nuts. <laughs> You I can't. Like <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that thing's just annoying. It it can't actually get into like a proper dog fight, so. No, well, the, it's it's like um, it's like how they had to fight in uh, Americans had to fight in Vietnam. They had to fly in, try and take him out, and then just fly away and then double back and then. Take what the fight. fuck? We're in a match with a tiger? What gives, saying? This ain't cool. Yeah, but who gives a damn? I'm an American tank. That means I only have turret armor. My turret is as small as humanly possible. My tank is as slow as humanly possible, except for maybe your tank. And I'm in yeah. I'm in a match with things that can take me out in one shot. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Yeah. Y you know what? When you have 90,000 people on at once, maybe that's a good time to rewrite matchmaking so it's only within one to two tiers of yourself. You're not going to make the matches be any slower. In fact, they're probably waiting on the server. Because the server yeah. can only handle like uh, a certain amount of matches at once. I think it's like 10,000 or 20,000. I don't remember exactly. Uh, what I do remember, though, is that it did cap out early in, uh, early in Russian release. And then they increased the server cap. And the day after they increased the server cap, it would still reach server cap. <laughs> because the game got that popular that fast and they were just like holy shit yeah I know I am going behind this building for precisely that reason because you see they never go around False. that way unless you're a medium mediums are fucking sneaky bitches <laughs> I missed I hit him I got him what? Uh, it's dead. I got I got the that got a hurt sound clip and yet I managed to not do a single hit point of damage to that thing. Oh, I get that what all the, time. the fuck? So, rather annoying. And I hit him too. It wasn't like it wasn't like I dinged him or something. It was a straight on hit to that. Ah, uh, whatever. And now he's playing building games with me because he's a jackass. And he's not even playing building games, he just wants to spot me so his team can shoot at me and somebody stole my kill. God damn it. I was waiting there for that fucker. Because now I'm surrounded by heavies and I'm gonna die. That's okay. Probably. I no, let's let's change that probably. There's two of them over there and one of them over here that's about to fucking fire at me. Let's see if I can get a shot out of him. And no, he's just gonna go around the corner straight up. And look at that, I am down to 140 out of 600 in one hit. Oh yeah, and did I ever mention that it's a properly high-tiered heavy tank that I'm going against? Two hits and I'm dead. And that was in the front armor too, it's not like he hit me in the back, no. Front. Hey, our team won that one. Yeah, I got my double experience on, let's see if I can, nope, can't unlock anything. Uh, actually, wait a second, I can unlock some tracks. <laughs> that sounds exciting. Let's do it. I love tracks. <laughs> Yay, tracks. <laughs> oh, right. I clicked guns instead, just because that's what I really want on this thing, is a bigger gun, but no. I'm being screwed here. I'm not too far away from getting my, uh, larger cannon on the KV. Uh, yeah, I still don't understand why you're using the large turret if you don't have the largest gun, um, but whatever. I don't know. Because you're a derp, that's why. <laughs> that's really why. You should be using the smaller turret until you get the big gun. Not the 152mm Hauser, but the big motherfucker that kills things in one hit. What, the 150? No, not the 150. I just told you, not the 150, because that, that thing is the troll gun. Because it can only hit things when you're point blank, and you've seen how fast a KV moves. <laughs> yeah. That gun you just get to load it up with AT ammo and then run around being like troll lol 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 I just did 900 damage in one hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was hilarious. Uh, yesterday, I was playing this and I was in my KV and there was a fucking... But the funniest fucking thing it was, he comes right out of a bush, 
and he sees me, and I see him, and I start moving my turret to just, you know, what the fuck, own him, and then he starts backing up to the bush. <laughs> like, mm -hmm. uh, kidding, Huggles? <laughs> that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> uh, I agree with that move. <laughs> but he starts backing up like, dude, I already saw you. You're fucked. Yeah, but dude, I mean, come on, ostrich defense here. Just give the man a chance. He can't see you, you can't see him. <laughs> okay, tank goes into bush, tank comes out of bush. Oh, hey, it's a PZ Trays. Oh, shit. See if I can. Nope, can't shoot that guy. And. Oh, I am like afraid of what will happen when that PZ3 comes out from behind those hills. It will not be pretty at all. I'm hiding behind this building. <laughs> Fuck these guys. PZ3s can. PZ3 was one of my favorite tanks once I got the little snump cannon on it and loaded with HE ammo. Because it, it was a troll gun. It was just like, okay, so I'm in a really fast tank, and I can't actually get a gun that will hit things. So let me just get this thing and pretend I have a shotgun. <laughs> oh, that oh balls. I'm going to go hide behind this hill before I get decimated. And I, I probably love still my, will. I love my M2 uh, medium. Really? That tank was garbage when I played it, but whatever. Oh, God fucking damn it! That PZ-3 with his troll gun is getting at me. Got uh. PZ -2. Oh, oh, that wasn't you. That was another dude. Oh, shit. I'm going to run. For my life. And his bullet just went through the sand dune. That makes a lot of sense. Or maybe I should be calling it a shell. Be like tank correct. Tank grammar Nazis. <laughs> you are fucked, Mr. Hertz. Mr. Hertz, what? Oh, You're talking shit, to I the head, sir? Is that you right on top of him? Yeah. No, I'm too busy killing a PZ to loot ah, the nuke. Let's I see if I can actually me. get this nuke down over here. Uh, 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 what? What? I missed at this distance? There. About damn time. I had my sights on him too. It, it was like an unfair miss. Hey, God beam. Yeah, I know. I'm gonna get killed, but whatever. I can't do anything about it. My tracks are fucked. Four. God damn it. No, he was at 4%. I could have gotten the kill. Rage. That really annoys me, though, because you see, when you go into gunsight mode, you're, when you hit the limits of your turret, it doesn't swivel. And that annoys me. I want it to swivel, because I go into gunsight mode a lot, and it just makes no sense. And I think we won. Yeah. yeah. Yay, I got a grand of experience. Let's see if I can get a... Nope, can't get the turret. Which one did you say I should get? The uh, 122, 107, or the 76? Alright, alright. Let me open this up here on my screen so I can actually pretend to know what I'm talking about. Okay, so the way it works is you get the KV-2 tracks, uh, you get the KV-2 turret. Uh, this whole time you're using the 122. Then once you have the, K uh, the KV-2 turret, you go for the 107 Zis 6 And once you get that gun, that's when you put on your KV-2 turret. Okay. Up until then, you're using the 122 howitzer, which is kind of a troll gun, but slightly less than the 152. Hmm. And then after you get your 107 millimeter, that's when you get your engine. That's usually the path that I like to take for for uh, my KV. It it works out nice. Alrighty. Well, I just got the uh, gun. So. What yeah. gun? The eleven. Uh, one twenty-two. 
Yeah, the, the U11. Alright, so... Ready to go-go? Yeah, just a second. I'm looking at the turret. So, that one. Gotcha. Oh, shit, I have to buy ammunition. Ball sack. Ha-ha! <laughs> Can only afford... 14 rounds. Doesn't matter, it's a troll gun, dude. I know. You won't be firing much, but when you do, you'll do a lot of damage, and you see what that does, it gives you more XP. Because you get well, XP yeah. based on your damage, so... Well, that's why, that's why I like my M2, for the tier that I was in, I love the M2, is because the howitzer, I like to call it the stubby, just because it's, like, too Yeah, I called it the stub. My M2 medium experience was not that enjoyable. It was not half as bad as the Stuart, though. The Stuart was the worst. The best, the best amount of uh, gameplay that I had was two matches. We, I lucked out, and we had half the team were M2s, and we had two KVs, and we all just bum rushed the uh, the base, and we all had the howitzers. Nice. So pretty much Oh god, I don't remember how to play I have not played on this map enough to know how to play it, period. <laughs> I, I've only played this map many times, so I have no idea. Alright, here, um... Let's, let's go camp in that hill forest and expect them to come over that hill over there. I think that will work out nicely. Okay. And hey, what do you know? The KV's doing the same thing. Hm. I need a new fucking engine. Oh no, your, t your tank doesn't actually get better with engines at all no. like it's very unnoticeable let's put it that way that's why I say get him last personal experience so uh, your one. your tracks on that tank will actually give you more of a speed boost than the engines yeah well that was the first thing I got yeah tracks are awesome but uh the so Pretty much the engine probably just reduces the chance it has to catch on fire. Oh, another time, uh, the T, the M2, when I got lucky on a uh, KV, I killed a KV from, I think, 60% because I lit his engine on fire and he died. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, the engines do add power, but it doesn't really translate to much speed. Let me put it to you this way, you have... A limping cow, which is like the original, and then you have a limping cow after a week. <laughs> I mean, either way, it's a fucking limping cow and will not get anywhere with any sort of speed. And hey, look, it's a KV. And I had a green reticle and I didn't penetrate that KV turret. That makes very little sense, but... No, no, stop. Vital, stop. Don't move. Don't go over that hill, you dumb ass cunt. <laughs> oh, that thunder twat. He is going right into the line of fire of that KV. 54%. That, sir, is what you get. I'm going to pretend I'm, I'm a medium tank for a second. Just going to bum rush. Oh, there's a tank. There's a TD over there. Yep. Oh, man. It shot me right as I was getting ready to shoot. Oh, what? The bounce? Oh, this game does not like to give me killing blows. Another bounce. No, that one just didn't penetrate. What gives? 92 fucking percent damage on that bitch. I did not penetrate the back armor of a KV. That is how bad this uh, how bad this gun is. I just <laughs> shot him directly in the back at his engine bay and it did not penetrate. That is how god awful this gun is. Let me just underline that again. For anyone who is considering this tank, it is worth it. Because the next tank rocks, but while you are in this tank, just it's like getting your balls electrocuted. It's bad. Don't tase me, bro. Don't make me play the T1 I heavy. I've balls electrocuted before, but actually, hey, have you ever noticed if you actually do get electrocuted? Not on your testicles, because, yeah, that would really suck. But... If you actually got electrocuted because um, I've had that happen twice. One time was from an arc motor, which was not enjoyable. The other one was a low voltage, and it actually felt really good for like two seconds. 
Oh yeah, well they use like electroshock like treatments and stuff in like general life and stuff. Oh yeah. But, I to mean... like help people and yeah. Uh, actually when I broke my elbow I had like ultrasound and electric treatments on it to get it to sort of move. Those were nice. Oh, one shot at that M2 there. That's funny. Yep. I told you, it's it's an awesome gun for getting experience, just because when you do hit something, it kills it. <laughs> and yeah. it probably, the sad thing is, it probably has the same penetration as the gun on this tank, but does like 500 damage a shot. Balanced? Fuck no. And that dumbass artillery just shot this building. Haha. <laughs> then again, this thing takes, what, 20 seconds or 30 seconds of reload. Yeah, but you need to get used to that, because the fact of the matter is, all heavies take that long to reload, and god damn it, what is shooting at me? Whatever it is, it can penetrate me, which isn't saying much. That just means it's like stronger than like, a Panzer II. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna bother capturing their base, I'm actually gonna go and try and get our friendly base out of trouble. Specifically, there's this Panzer III that's rushing towards our base that I feel will meet his doom very soon. And I would feel bad if it happened. And holy shit, they have one tank with five kills. That is pretty impressive. But they also have one tank with negative kills. Yeah, <laughs> un shit, game over. Oh well, that sucks. Yeah. I want to see who this five kill wonder is. That's my question here. An M4 Sherman. Oh, yeah, he's way above this tier. Oh, cool. You finally got your, uh, sniper. Huh? You got your sniper, uh, badge. I've had one for a while, but, uh, thank you. Oh, you got another one, then. <laughs> yeah. I get those frequently. I actually have pretty decent aim. I just never bother with positioning. And I can finally get my turret. 14 experience left. Yay! I get to upgrade to a turret that has the same armor... Worse turning speed and slightly better sight radius. But, here's the catch. It will increase my hit points from 600 to 660. How does that make sense? It doesn't. But who gives a damn? Because that's the way this game works. It always amuses me how you can upgrade to a turret that's technically worse. Like the M2. When you upgrade to the second turret, it's got a fucking hole in the top of it. That's pretty hazardous for your crew members, but you get more hit points for doing it. Hmm. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's go into another match. That last one was successful, and I want to shit on this tank some more before we're done with this. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? 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 This is... Wait, I'm going to double-check myself here, but I think I've just been bullshitted. KV... Inf uh, KV, show info. Yeah, rear armor, 65 millimeters. My gun has 101 millimeters of penetration, and I didn't penetrate. How does this work? My minimum, my minimum value for penetration is 76 millimeters. His rear armor is 75 millimeters. How? I don't trust this game at math. It sucks. <laughs> I, I've I, been noticing that. I had a 100% chance to penetrate that KV's rear armor, and that did not happen. Yeah, that's, that is quite serious, but yeah. KV is overpowered for its tier. Uh, well, I did one-shot two guys, pretty much. <laughs> Time to roll out. One, one, one was like, what, 92%. Damn, that... That always does make me smile a little bit. Yeah, all chat. What's goody? <laughs> Thunder cunt. That's Thunder my new. Cunt. That's my new insult for the night. Oh man, you know it, Jack. Oh man, you're so funny. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Man. <laughs> oh, censored shit. Oh, that's so funny. Wait a second. There, I spy with my slightly abnormally sized turret a heavy tank coming up our middle, as well as a light. And that light interests me a lot more. 
Oh, it's an M5 Stewart. Let's make somebody else's life miserable. And he just shot at me and did damage. We have no heavies on the right side, so we'll go over here. And because I didn't even notice that they were there and didn't slow down. <laughs> yep. Well, you see, I have situational awareness. I am aware of the situation, and I'm not talking about the Jersey Shore situation that is apparently running rampant in your country. What do you mean, gunner is dead? How do you shoot me once and get a crit on my gunner, you jackass? You should be more considerate. Well, now I'm penetrating this KV from the front multiple times in a row. This makes hmm. very little sense. And I think I'm being artillery or something or other. Something's bullshitting me right now, though. Yeah, something annoying is hitting me. I missed. Damn it. Hey, Mr. Stuka. Oh, hey, it's a BT-7. One shot. <laughs> yeah, those tanks are squishy, but hey, at least they're fast, you know? There's tanks in this game that are really squishy and slow. And they're the ones who it sucks oh, to be. fucking bollocks! Bollocks? Oh, you, you're British now, mate. <laughs> I've been swearing like that ever since I was 11, dude. I have, I have yet to hear you say bollocks in a single one of your Let's Plays, I will be honest with you. That's because I usually don't... Well, certain times I swear, just complete and utter bullshit I do, but... And then sometimes you're like an incorrigible twat and a fucking drunken sailor, all <laughs> rolled into one. Well... Oh, goddamn, he got me. Okay, I got a critical on his tracks without actually doing damage to him. And I just... I just did not penetrate the side of a KV. What gives? Oh. See, right there, I would swear like a Brit. But when I actually have a reasonable, you know, state of mind, I don't. Ah. Uh, that is... That is just such... Just... Oh. Such a bloody tampon. I have a 100% chance to fucking penetrate, and I get a critical on his track. Okay, fine. I hit him in the side, got a track. Whatever. But then I hit him in the side, and it's like, Herp Derp, you didn't penetrate. Herp Derp. That's just unacceptable. Yeah, that's what also bothers me is, like, when it goes, Oh, you got a track. It's like, I'm sorry. I would have gotten a little bit more than just this track with that shot. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, what kind of material is this track made out of that it stops a shot? And the thing that I never get is when I get shot in the track, I take damage. I shoot him in the track, he doesn't take damage. It's weird. It's like fucking wait, magnets. How do they work? Wait, it's not weird. It's bollocks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's complete another tosser cunt muffin. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking British people, how do they work? <laughs> oh, man. Actually, it's, it's they consider funny, cunt twat uh, <laughs> to be legitimate insults. <laughs> it's just so funny. Uh, whatever. Anyways, gear up in your 28. I'm taking my <laughs> SU out for a uh, spin. Spray paint the front of it. F you. <laughs> To rush in, get behind them, and then shoot their back armor, and lose 50% of their company <laughs> in the process. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That doesn't that doesn't sound like legitimate tank tactics to me. But then again, fuck do the Americans know about tank tactics? They've never fought a tank war. Last time they tried, they ended up going into a city with tanks, only to have them blown up from the building tops with fucking RPGs. <laughs> <laughs> And it's not like you can miss an M1 Abrams. That thing is a, just a Mesopotamic landmass. That tank does not make any pretenses at being small, compact, sprite, or any of the above. <laughs> yeah. 
Speaking of which, where are you? I can't see you. I do I'm see somebody named Wookie. Hey, Wookie and his Sherman. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, mine's pretty awesome. That's all I have to say here. I know that I'm standing next to a guy named Wookie and a Sherman. I know I'm getting shot by artillery that is somehow magically navigating the buildings around me. And we lost one of our artillery pieces, and apparently our base is being captured. Yeah, I'm going to go get on that right now. That's kind of embarrassing, to be honest with you. Same here. Uh, oh, it's a light tank, that's why. Oh, that's, hi, buddy. Is it a Leo? No, it's probably the no. stew. It's a steward. It, yeah, it is the stew. What did he kill? Oh, a Vesp. Yeah, they can kill a Vesp. I killed him. That's probably me butchering German right there. Hey. But what can what can you do? Tubby. What was that? Sorry. Huh? <laughs> You're saying something? Yeah, I was. I was saying how badly I was butchering the German there by calling it a Vesp. <laughs> Actually, yeah, Vesp. No, it would definitely be like Vespensch, Diamensch, Diggin, Hund, Kahn. Nine! Nine, nine, nine! Damen Herr! I always love people whenever I, uh, whenever they're trying to learn German, it's like, okay, when you're gaming, this is one that you need to know. Ich für nicht. Translation? Roughly? Do not want. <laughs> what, you think the Germans try and uh, cyber some people there? <laughs> I mean, they're already pretty rampant in the adult industries. Oh, wow, I actually managed to hit a 3485 with some success, and he does not realize that I'm behind him yet. He's thinking that he's being shot from the front because he's a complete tool. And he still hasn't... Now he's turned his turret. Okay. And he managed to miss me. Considering he's standing still, that is an embarrassment. <laughs> that one went right through and did absolutely no damage because it got stopped by his magic tracks. And if he gets another yeah. shot off at me, I'm dead. I just killed a 3485 solo in an SU-85B. Not even the fully fledged 85. And speaking of 34s... Uh, I think I'm at about that much hit points. No, 47. Close enough. Gonna maneuver around, trying to get... Oh, I can't go over that way. Shit. Wait, no, I can. Yes. Either this will be extremely, extremely smart or extremely stupid. Uh, judging by where you're showing up when I'm holding the alt key, extremely stupid. It, yeah. No, that's stupid. <laughs> what I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna go for the flank to tank. Some dude just fucking nailed him from the uh, castle up there. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's one of the nicer places where you can post up if your tank has any sort of accuracy to it. Yeah. Oh, Dice is doing pretty well with his 3485 there. Killing plenty of tank of tanks. And their their team managed to lose most of their good tanks. That's quite surprising. Then again, their 3485 was a derp. Uh, later later viewing of the footage will show that he stood there for a grand total of six shots, not turning his turret, while I was directly behind him shooting him in the back. And I what? Oh. Look behind you. What, that? I don't care. I'm gonna die anyways, there's no point in turning around. Yeah. I might as well get some shots off. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. Whatever. We did well. Well enough. Well, I just didn't know that you... I forgot you are in a... Uh... Oh, wow, 180? That's all I get? Man, that's such a jib. I got a kill last round. I got 226. Hey, we won. Yay. I got a master gunner, apparently. Psh, what a joke. Oh, that's for my SU-85. Actually, that makes sense. <laughs> I was pretty masterful with my gunsmanship. Anywho.